Now, your exclusive Storm Team forecast from KTVO. Expect more. But well, we do have some light snow that's going to be moving in Thursday night. A brief warm up for Friday, but then back down into the freezer. Colder temperatures return starting on Sunday. But this is what we're dealing with tonight very cold temperatures. In fact, a wind chill advisory is in effect until noon on Thursday. Uh, Kirksville is not in this. However, northeast Missouri, southeast Iowa is all going to be receiving. The same very cold temperatures along with those strong winds. So regardless, if you're not in that advisory, still take heed because it is going to be very cold out there. Mostly clear skies across the area right now. Those clear skies will continue to stay with us for tonight. In fact, right now, 12 degrees at the Kirksville Regional Airport. Northwest winds around 13 miles per hour. A time will come in at 8 degrees with mostly sunny skies. Northwest winds around 18 miles per hour. Factor in those winds, and this is what it feels like out there. It feels like already 3, three degrees below zero in Kirksville. 11 degrees below zero is what it feels like in Ottumwa. Centerville, minus 4. And at Mount Pleasant, it feels like 9 degrees below zero. So bundle up for tonight as well as we head into tomorrow because it's going to be just as cold for tomorrow. Again, I talked about that snow moving in. It'll move in late tomorrow night. This is around 10 o'clock. So I would say anywhere between 9 to 10 o'clock, expecting uh, from west to east. That's when the snow is going to continue to move through. It's going to be out of here very quickly by early Friday morning. Uh, and then we'll see actually a slight warm up for Friday and into Saturday. So how much snowfall expected with this round? Less than an inch expected for southeast Iowa as well as northeast Missouri. So you can expect uh, to be cleaning off your car early Friday morning on your way to work and school. Temperatures for tonight into the single digits by midnight and then plunging below zero. In fact, three degrees below zero at five at 7 a.m., four degrees below zero. For tonight, four degrees below zero is going to be the overnight low. Northwest winds gusting to 20 miles per hour. Again, that's going to make the wind chill feel anywhere from about 10 to 20 degrees below zero. Same thing as we're heading into tomorrow. More sunshine, 13 degrees as your high northwest winds, light 5 to 10 miles per hour. At least if we do have any kind of silver lining, it's going to be those winds are going to be dying down as we're heading throughout the day tomorrow. We've got that snow moving in Thursday night. Temperatures dropped about 7 degrees. Warming up on Friday, 28 with cloudy skies. 31 on Saturday with a 50% chance of snow. Saturday night as well, dropping down to 9 degrees. 18 on Sunday, 0 degrees Sunday night. Of course, anytime, check us out 24-7 at heartlandconnection.com. These below normal temperatures are going to continue even into next week. We should actually be about 39, 40 degrees. Yeah, that would feel pretty good about now. It would it? feel very good, yeah. <laughs> okay, thanks, Teresa. You're welcome. We'll be right back.